we need to calculate the average rate of change of the internet users per 100 habitants between 2000 and 2004. One easy way of setting this up is to think of them as points. So let's think of the year 2000 as time zero. And so at zero, the developed world had 31 internet users per 100 inhabitants, and the developing or undeveloped world had two. We'll do the same thing for 2004, but if we're thinking of 2000 as year zero, then 2004 is year four. And in 2004, the developed world was up to 54 users per 100 inhabitants. The undeveloped world was up to seven. So now, calculating average rate of change is just like calculating slope. So we do change in y minus, excuse me, change in y divided by change in x. And so for the developed world, we get 23 fourths, and we'll interpret these in, in a second. And for the undeveloped world, we get 7 minus 2, change in y over change in x. Or we get 5 fourths. So, as uh, let's change these into decimals. So, for the developed world, we have 5.75, which is the 23 fourths. And what, do, what did we find? Well, we found that the rate that the internet users is increasing. So, internet users are increasing in the, develop, in the developed world by 5.75. Now, the units are kind of interesting here, but remember, they just come from what we did up here. Our output was users per 100 inhabitants. So 5.75 users per 100 inhabitants. And then we still have another per in here. Per year. So let's think about what this means. Between 2000 and 2004, we found that the number of internet users is increasing. We know it's increasing because this number is positive. We found what it was increasing by, which is 5.75. And then the units on that are our output units, so users per 100 inhabitants per our input units, which was years. We could do the same thing for the developing world. So between 2000 and 2004, the number of internet users was increasing by 1.25 users per 100 inhabitants per year.